I want to show y'all something. How out of pocket this bitch is, okay? And how much of a drama queen this bitch is. And, and this show you that she clout chasing. This right here is beyond a reasonable doubt that this bitch is clout chasing and is trying to build her platform off of uh, drama and turmoil with the family. Yes, this is the bitch with the roaches. Now, uh, I don't want nobody to think I be stalking this bitch page, okay? Because I don't. I blocked the bitch after I went in on the bitch, okay? But just like I knew the bitch was going to keep up with the drama. Now, let me tell y'all what this bitch didn't did. One of the family members who I had on here, okay? Just I just spoke with him. Just sent me the screen recording. You can even see my messages come through the screen recording. So I say that to say I'm not, you know, I don't give a fuck about what this bitch is doing. But with that being said, this bitch, Jazzy, went on this woman page, scrolled down her whole motherfucking Instagram a whole year ago, and then reposted her shit, trolling and harassing this woman on her page. Now, here's the thing. What does any of this shit got to do with Nature Boy is what I'm trying to figure out. The woman who Jazzy is harassing hasn't said anything negative about Jazzy. She even said she she just want her to dip, her to leave them alone. The shit is on my YP Instagram live page. The family didn't come on here and get crazy. All she said was she wanted them to leave her alone. And this bitch is still is not only still on her YouTube page. Okay, put my name in videos and doing shit for clout. This bitch is now stalking the Instagrams of the families. Okay, stalking. Look, cause ain't nobody gonna tell me I'm making shit up. Look, look. Excuse me, look at here. Look at here. Let me pull this shit up. Look. Here we go. Look. This my message at the top. This proves it was... Look, I said, okay, send me the screen recording while she was screen recording. Now look, this the bitch Instagram. She done went down this girl whole motherfucking page. Okay? Whole motherfucking page. Harass, look. This light blew my mind. So I am so thankful that God blessed me with another year. And y'all watch out for me. Because this year is not over. Look, this so Jazzy. Me, happy belated happy birthday. birthday. Mm. What you mean? Mm. Look out, Why is you I fucking see, with this woman? I think I look pretty good. What's wrong with this bitch? Y'all be blessed. Peace. Listen. Happy birthday. Listen to Jazzy. Here go Jazzy right here. Listen. Happy birthday, Kia. Happy belated birthday to you. And you do look damn good to be 37. What's wrong? What's wrong with this bitch? Now, this is me at the top. Let me show y'all me at the top. These my messages coming through. I said, wasn't that bitch just talking about harassment? Okay? Because that's the same bitch that was just crying harassment. Okay? That's the same bitch that was just crying harassment. Why is she fucking with these people? And then y'all want to look at me like I'm tripping because I told the bitch to leave these people alone. Bitch, that's... that. What's wrong with you? Why is you fucking with these people? Why is you scrolling down this woman's page a year ago talking about happy birthday, you look good to be 37? She going on 38 now? You done went down this woman's whole page to go find some shit to reap. Like, is you trying to be funny? Telling this woman, oh, uh, what you gonna call it? You look good to be 37. Bitch, is you trying to be funny? Why is you? This is my question, y'all. The family said they don't want her talking about them no more. Okay? Bitch still didn't stop. Tried to put some bullshit out on me. I had to check her real quick. Still didn't stop. Now the bitch then went another step further. And instead of talking about Nature Boy... What do she do? She go to the family pages. And now she's harassing them directly. Why? The family haven't said nothing about you. The family haven't said nothing about... Why is you fucking... Excuse me. Why is you fucking with these people family, man? What's wrong with you? Now, here's the thing. Because I'm finna roast and toast the bitch. This all I want to say. The internet don't have no rules. Everybody can see the internet. So now Jazzy is stepping in deep water. Okay? 
I'll tell you why. Because these ain't, this ain't motherfucking VH1. This is real life. These people, family members, is seeing this. So all you gonna do is turn up and get half of New Orleans on your motherfucking head. That's all you're gonna do. You harassing these people and exploiting these people's situation with their family member for views. For views. For views. And then they ask you to stop and you now directly harassing them. What's wrong with you, bitch? Get a life. Can you go get a life? Why you fucking with these people? I understand why you clout chasing me because you want some views. My name bring views. That's understood. Why you clout chasing this family? Okay? Because when New Orleans or they family get pissed off and they start getting on your head, bitch, we don't want to hear nothing about, oh, you getting, you know, people, you getting harassed. We don't want to hear that. We don't want to hear. Listen, let me tell you how negligent. And, and stupid this bitch is before I roast this bitch. Okay? Let me tell you how negligent this bitch is. How many kids you got in your house? I think four. Why would you be doing something that could potentially put turmoil in your household? Why would you do that? Why are you playing with these people's family and harassing these people's family? Because if one, if one, if somebody, if one of these women say, bitch, repost something else. And watch I come beat your ass. Let's let's hypothetically say that happened. The first thing you're going to be doing is you're going to be talking about, oh, I got kids over here and this, that, and the third, and they threatening me. Leave them alone. Why don't you, why won't you leave these people alone? Bitch, get what's wrong with you? You the main bitch always talking about, I don't need YouTube. I can, I do other shit. We can't tell. We can't, bitch, it looks to me like you need YouTube, bitch. Fuck is wrong with you? Now let me drag the bitch, okay? Let me drag the bitch, okay? And yes, I'm calling. I know some of y'all was like, "Oh, you calling her a bitch?" Hell yeah, I'm calling that bitch a bitch. Fuck wrong with you, bitch? You tried it with me when you went and got that that fucking zombie ass receipt, bitch. That put back together Frankenstein ass motherfucking receipt, bitch. That's what you got. That's you. You tried it with me, bitch. That's called slander. So you all kind of bitches when it come to me, bitch. But with that being said, let me show y'all something, right? Because instead of instead of trolling people, okay, look at look, and she posted it. Okay? I don't want nobody saying I posted this. I photoshot she put po look, trifling ass heifer. How you got the cat eating off a paper plate? Floor dirty as a motherfucker. Okay? Let's get on the cabinets now. Look at the cabinets. Look. Look at the, what the look at this. But you look at this shit. Look. Come on, man. This how you living. This shit say welcome. Look at this shit. This how you living, though. In your crib. Look at the door. Man, this shit look like motherfucking... Man. 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 But you, but you got all the time in the world. You got all the time in the world... To be scrolling down another motherfucker's social media to harass them. But this just how your house look when we enter the motherfucker. So, if we was to walk through that bitch, I'm, I'm petrified. Look. Look what somebody commented. Somebody said, the door in the cabinets need some scrubbing. The floor could use a little cleaning also. Jazzy trifling ass said, show this is true. This is true. We'll get the cleaning. How you going to, let me tell you something. I pointed out the roach. She acknowledged the roach. I don't see her fumigating. She can't be fumigating her house. Because she just posted this today. She just posted this today. But then you come on the motherfucker. So you didn't fumigate. Which means you didn't do anything to get rid of the roach. We can prove that. Okay. Because you ain't going to be feeding no cat or be in no house where there's bombs going on. So, you didn't care that you had a roach, which means you already knew you had roaches, okay? Because I ain't going to hold y'all up, nigga. My pride ain't that high. And I'm, and my, my shit be up here. And my pride ain't that high. I would have came right back on here like, listen, y'all, I did not know I had a roach. Look, y'all, I bumped my shit, cleaned my shit, my shit clean. I didn't know. 
that shit. We all found out I had a roach together and that bitch was gone that day. But since she's not acting on it, that means she already knew. Now, the nasty ass trifling ass trick is going to come on the internet and she trolling Velvet family, Ileana family, and what you and you keep clapping yourself. Your house is nasty. Why is you in these people business talking about these people household, worrying about people household and your shit look like bitch I listen. When I was selling crack. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit listen bitch when I sold crack as a young black man in America bitch my trap house was cleaner than that bitch we had a rug on the floor mirrors on the motherfucking wall couches is you crazy bitch I know trap houses that look better than your shit you crack and I, I put that I put that on my motherfucking life Bitch, my trap house. Is you crazy? Is you crazy? Bitch, my trap house was cleaner than your house. I'm not even playing with you. I'm dead ass serious. When we was... Nigga, what? When we was hitting licks? What? Big ass TV? Rug? Vacuum? What you talking about? And if we didn't clean it... Here, let me hit you. Clean that. Up to down. It was clean. You crazy as hell. You crazy as hell. Bitch, the trap house better than your motherfucking house. And you on the internet. Worried about another motherfucker. Now, let me tell y'all what's so funny. Right? Because this called trifling. Let me show y'all how trifling she is. Look. Let me go back to the last picture. Look. Let me show y'all how trifling she is. Feeding the motherfucking cat off a paper plate. Feeding the motherfucking cat off a paper plate. Now you might say, Pharaoh, that's trifling. I mean, why is that trifling? Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. This is a grown-ass, big-ass cat. Okay? Now you might say, damn, Pharaoh, well, why is that important? Let me tell you why this is important. Either she had this cat from the time it was a motherfucking kitten, or she bought that cat as a grown-ass cat. Now, let me tell you why either one of those scenarios is important. Bitch, you knew you had a cat. You knew you had a cat. You knew you had a cat. You can't go to Family Dollar, Dollar General, the 99 cent store, and buy a fucking cat bowl? That's how trifling you is? Damn, bitch, you can't buy a fucking cat bowl, bitch? What you talking about? What are you talking about? You can't buy a cat bowl? Is you serious? So if the motherfucker eat off the paper plate, what he drink out of? Yo bowl? What he drink? Yo bowl? I'm dying to motherfucking know. If the motherfucker eat out of out of paper plate, what he drink out of? Yo shit? Come on, man. That's called trifling and negligence. See, y'all might think, Pharaoh, you being petty. Why you bringing that up? Because it shows you how negligent she is. This bitch walk in and out the house every goddamn day, knowing the goddamn cat ain't got a motherfucking bowl. But her trifling ass won't spend one dollar on a cat bowl. This shows that she does not do what she's supposed to do as a grown ass woman. This shows that she does not take care of her motherfucking primary objectives first because she's too busy worried about what's going on outside her house. All the way to the point now where the family again, because it's not me. I just showed y'all the screenshot. The family again has to tell me that this bitch is harassing them. Even now, more so than before. So your house got roaches, okay, from what we've seen. We ain't making shit up. Your shit dirty from what we've seen. You've acknowledged both these motherfucking accusations, okay? And you haven't done anything to clean your shit. Not the roaches, not the walls. You ain't even mop. What kind of trifling motherfucker will look at a dirty floor and still take a picture of it? What's wrong with you? But you could have at least cleaned up that one little spot if you was going to snap a flick. You could, what you talking about? See, trifling, trifling, trifling. Look, let me pin that comment. I like that one. Distracting her 
She's distracting herself from her issues with other people's issues. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. That's hella trifling. So I, I can only imagine what the rest of your motherfucking house look like. Okay? And you got kids in there. So I'm going to be a little bit nice. I'm going to be a little bit nice. Because you got kids in there. But I, I can only imagine what them kids' rooms look like. I can only imagine what that bathroom look like. I can only imagine what your motherfucking room look like. Okay? Is you washing clothes over there? Huh? Is you washing clothes? But you worry about somebody else's shit. And so, let me not even toss her ass off the motherfucking roof. Okay? Like I'm about to do. Because she already jumped off the motherfucker. But this is the point I'm trying to make. These people be on the internet be miserable as hell. And they present themselves as one way, but they really not that way. Okay? They present themselves. Ain't this the same motherfucker on the internet talking about she deals with psychology? This is the same motherfucker talking about they deal with psychology. Do y'all hear me? Do y'all hear me? This the same motherfucker talking about she deal with psychology. And your house look like that. But you don't think it's something psychologically wrong with you? That you got four kids in a roach infested dirty ass house that you don't clean? But you ain't got to be rich to have a clean house? You can have a one bedroom apartment in the projects and that shit could be clean and decked out. Motherfucker. What you talking about? You ain't got to have no mansion to clean your house. Everybody got to start somewhere, but bitch, it better be clean. So you on the internet, trolling these motherfucking people, worried about their family, worried about what, what, what Nature Boy over there doing, and you not even worried about if your kids got a clean place to lay their motherfucking head. That's just the bottom line. That's just the bottom line. Ain't no motherfucking way my kids living in that. Ain't no motherfucking way my kids living in that. Ain't no motherfucking way my kids living in that. And if the shit is, if the shit get too too out of pocket, bitch, we got to move and start over. But ain't no motherfucking way I got four kids living in that. Ain't no motherfucking way. Ain't no motherfucking way. Ain't no motherfucking way. Damn, do the cat got a litter box? Do the cat got a litter box? Do the cat got a litter box? Look how you living. But you worried about motherfucking. You worried about motherfucking uh. Nature Boy and how they living. You worry about Nature I heard Nature Boy yell at a motherfucker for not cleaning up. I ain't gonna lie. On, I heard that. Now, he might not wash up. That's another story. But I heard Nature Boy yell at a motherfucker for not cleaning up. I did hear that. Maybe you need Nature Boy at your motherfucking house. Nature, Nature Boy, you need it. Your assistance is needed. Your narcissistic ass ways is needed somewhere. We needed you to go yell at a motherfucker and tell them to clean their shit. Okay? But with that being said, I'm not going to be on here all night because I got shit to do. But I will say this. It's no reason. Okay? And my damn uh, iPad about to die, too. But it's no reason why this bitch is stalking the family. See? See? Now, let me say this to y'all. Because the bitch a clout chaser. And I know she's going to respond and try to flip it. But I want to say this. If that bitch respond, don't let that bitch lie to y'all and say I'm fucking with her. Don't let that bitch lie to y'all and say that I'm dragging shit on. She's dragging shit on. Still posting videos about the family. And I just showed y'all on her Instagram, she went down one of the family members' Instagram, I mean social medias, scroll all the way back a year ago when they just had Turk 37 and reposted it trying to be funny. Come on, man. Is you serious? Is you serious? Leave these people alone. Leave these motherfucking people alone, man. Leave these motherfucking people alone. So now what, family? Let me ask y'all. Now what do y'all suggest the family do? I'm just saying, what do y'all suggest the family do at this point in time? What do y'all what do y'all what do y'all suggest the family do? God damn. Motherfuckers. Motherfuckers went from goddamn, uh, motherfuckers went from goddamn, oh, somebody said it, is I'm still on that, uh, private investigator wave. You better believe it. You better believe it. And whenever I complete it, 
y'all gonna be the first to know. Believe that. But with that being said, why why won't she leave these people alone? Like, I don't understand the excuse, especially when they not fucking with her. And they people keep saying block her. The, excuse me, the family did block her. Which means this bitch probably got a troll page or she got somebody else going on these people page to motherfucking go get they they content and, and to harass them, which shows even more that she's being malicious towards the family for whatever reason, for views and clout. Because you shouldn't even be able to be on these people's page. Okay? I blocked the bitch. So if she grab anything off my page, bitch, you got a troll page or you have somebody come on here. So that being said, this shit out of pocket. And the shit getting all the way out of pocket now. Because I'm going to tell you what the bitch did. The bitch has undone all of the great work that we've done. So now as now when people, because I'm going to tell y'all why, I'm going to tell y'all why Jazzy fucking the whole wave up and then I'm going to go. This is why Jazzy fucking the wave up. I'm off the Nature Boy shit. All I cared about was Baby Migo. Okay? When I broke that shit up and I got Baby Migo to leave, y'all see I left the shit alone. If I wanted to, y'all don't think that I could keep banging on Nature Boy and, 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 and don't nobody want to waste their time talking about a waste of time? Okay? I left this shit alone after I accomplished my goal. Okay? Now, why is this important? This bitch, uh, I mean, excuse me, why is this important? People are going to keep going over there. But the blueprint that I laid out, this bitch is fucking the blueprint up. And I'm going to tell you why. Because when, when people, families, see that somebody was allowing them to come on their platform and speak out to their other family members, that can't be anymore. You know why? Because I'm not on a Nature Boy situation anymore. And this bitch is just like many other people where you fuck around and tell her your personal business and she gonna put the shit on the internet for views and clout. This bitch, and then if you tell the bitch to stop, the bitch gonna attack you from your own motherfucking social media. So this bitch is no more toxic, no more non-toxic than Nature Boy. Because now the families don't even have a safe place to go to complain, my nigga. They don't even got a safe place to go to complain. They don't even got a safe place to go and say, hey, my daughter or my son just went over there. You know, who got an outlet that I could, who got a platform that I could use as an outlet to say my piece or speak to my family? Because I'm not on the shit no more, okay? I, I say the vine not on the shit no more, Okay? So, with that being said, oh, black, black not on the shit either, he said. So, now it's just in the hands of this bitch. And this bitch is a, this bitch worse than him. This bitch worse than him. And so, with that being said, this bitch fucked up everything. Y'all didn't let this bitch fuck up everything. For those of you who might like the bitch, I mean, li li like Nature Boy and follow the bitch. Because she still keep y'all somewhat in... In, uh, in tune with Mr. Marquez, okay, and they side of the story, y'all don't even realize y'all didn't let this bitch fuck up everything because y'all motherfuckers was more in tune for drama and blood than y'all was for integrity, order, and blueprint. So now the blueprint is gone. So now, when, like, for example, it's two motherfuckers missing over there. I bet y'all y'all didn't know that. It's two motherfuckers. It's two motherfuckers I ain't heard from in a minute over there. But we'd never know. We'd never know where they at. Okay? Or what happened? Okay? Maybe they just ain't been on camera. But I ain't seen them. Okay? But with that being said, no, it's it's a rap for talking to people's family. It's a rap for getting to the bottom of shit. It's a rap for all of that. Because this bitch just fucked it up. And everybody who family come on here and see this shit. Okay? They not gonna trust no blogger, no so-called fake-ass journalist with their story. Because they're going to see this bitch putting people motherfucking business out on the internet. And then when you ask them nicely to stop, she's going to not only carry on with the bullshit, but she's going to motherfucking go on your page and personally attack you. So with that being said, this is what y'all left with. This is what y'all left with. Y'all left with a nigga who don't got nobody on his head no more. And I... I I laid down the perfect blueprint. This bitch fucked up the blueprint. And now it, it is what it is. It is what it is. 
But, um, I mean, listen, y'all. Listen, y'all. Listen, y'all. I don't know what to tell y'all. Only thing I'm going to say is this. Once again, the family has asked you to leave them the fuck alone. Please leave the family alone. I'm not saying the family has made any threats, anything like that. That has not happened. I'm just speaking from experience of living life. What happens when you keep fucking with people on the internet and they ask you to stop? We've seen plenty of videos on World Star where motherfuckers keep talking shit on the internet and then they run into the motherfucker that they won't leave alone. So all I'm saying is if you study psychology and you're supposed to be such a fucking mental health wizard and guru, what part of you have four kids, uh, apparently you're a single mother, and you're fucking with another people's family that could create turmoil, don't you understand? Who does that? You don't, somebody who was, who was honestly trying to make a career out of theyself wouldn't be doing shit like this. Why is you keep fucking with these people? Why these people got to keep calling me talking about what the fuck you're doing to them? So I'm going to let y'all know, family, the bitch is blocked. I blocked the bitch after the last time I went in on the bitch, okay? The family got the bitch blocked. The bitch is going out of her way to fuck with these people. And so, I've said what I've said. The family has said what they said. Bitch, you keep fucking with people. Keep fucking with people and see where that gets you. But with that being said, I'm gone, okay? And I'm going to say the same shit that I've been saying. Leave these people alone. These people don't want to be bothered by you. These people don't want to uh, deal with you. These people don't want you covering their family story anymore. Okay? No need to say shit about me, bitch. Because I don't care about you. I don't... You don't mean nothing to me. So there's no reason to be trying to start YouTube beef with me for clout. Because I'm going to ignore your dumb ass. But I will come on here once again to let y'all know that this bitch will not stop fucking with the family. She's the one carrying on the drama. She's the one carrying on the shit. And I'm showing y'all, okay? All the bitch had to do was go live days ago and say, you know what? Everybody said leave it alone. I'm going to leave them alone and report on Nature Boy. This bitch still not on Nature Boy. How you blogging about Nature Boy? You blogging about everything but Nature Boy. Why is your everything you do got to, got to be towards the family? Leave the family the fuck alone, man. God damn. God damn. But with that being said... Feel me? I'm getting ready to slide. Do my thug dizzle for the night. My battery almost died. I know some of y'all wanted to uh, come up and, you know, state y'all opinions about what's been going on. But I ain't got no battery for that right now. And I ain't got time. Uh, I got some other things I got to do for my personal channel. But with that being said, next time I come on, I'll let y'all come in and, you know, state y'all opinions and what y'all think of things like that. But, you know, family, it's just, it's just, it's just, you know, it, it's, it's a shame, man. It's a shame that people doing shit like this. And, uh, you know, I mean, it is what it is, man. It's a lot of de it's a lot of demonic motherfuckers on the internet, and that's just what it is. So, with that being said, I love y'all. Have a beautiful night. Enjoy y'all family members. Enjoy y'all lives. And clean y'all motherfucking houses if they not clean, especially if it's kids and them motherfuckers, okay? Don't know kids need to be going up like that trifling, because that's trifling, period, period. And if, listen... Listen, if ain't nobody gonna tell you, I'ma tell you. Get that motherfucking cat a bowl. He deserve he or she deserve a motherfucking bowl. Okay? A bowl, motherfucker. Not no paper plate. That's trifling. That's trifling. That's try and mop the floor, sweep the motherfucker, wipe the cabinets. Okay? Clean the motherfucking house. Okay, that's trifling. That's trifling. And I hope it ain't no niggas laying up in that motherfucker. I hope it ain't no niggas that ain't came up in there and ain't said shit, okay? Clean, clean the motherfucker up, fumigate the motherfucker. Matter of fact, skip every step that I just told you before. Make this first step. Fumigate the motherfucker. Fumigate the bitch. Bomb the bitch. Open the windows, leave. Go spend the night at whoever house. Make sure there ain't no roaches in your bags. Go spend the night at whoever house. And then come back. And clean the motherfucker. And then come back and get on the internet and talk about other people and what's going on in their home. And with that being said, family, have a good night. Love, excuse me. Love y'all. Peace.